Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame. So it might be nice to own a jet plane. I'm a dude. We've been on Coin Market Cap. You can see that there's been a sea of red very consistently in the month of January. So I'm gonna be explaining why this is happening and whether you should relax or not, or should you pull your cryptocurrency out. So we're gonna head over to this Reddit post. And basically it talks about the reason for the dip and the bull market will return. So as you know, the Asian market dominates crypto trading like vastly. The, the majority of money that comes in and out of crypto trading has to do with Asia. So most of the time, if they are selling a lot in large quantities, the price is gonna go down by a large percentage. Now, if you don't know what's coming up in the next couple of weeks, it's Lunar New Year. It's basically their version of our Christmas. So basically a lot of money goes into flowing back in, into fiat to buy presents and plane and train tickets. So people spent a lot of money during the Lunar New Year and also the large mass of migration of people on the planet occurring over two weeks happens around Lunar New Year. So that can easily be said why the price of crypto is going down. So projections are around 100 billion USD in spending, which is huge. So as you can see, the um, crypto market is around 700 billion closely to 800 billion so think about that if 100 billion or 150 billion dollars is sucked out of the market cap like that's gonna be huge that's gonna affect the bitcoin price that's gonna affect all the other coin prices because that's the wide variety of the, the coins put together so imagine 150 billion dollars sucked it out at one time like you're gonna see a lot of pitfalls you're gonna see a lot of coins go down so remember that the crypto market isn't like, it's kind of not like the stock market because the stock market booms when businesses is, are booming during the holidays, but the crypto investors are retail investors. They are not Wall Street investors. So most of the time when retail investors, when they, they tend to sell during the holidays to buy different goods and stuff like presents and all that to pay for travel. So usually during the holidays, that's the time when the prices tend to go down because people are selling their profits or whatever to pay for gifts and to travel. So as you can see, like around the December, January time, you notice that a lot of the prices started to go down a bit. So the sell off has happened exactly three weeks before the Lunar New Year each of the past four years. So we have a picture and basically it shows around the January ish time like what happened to crypto or what happened to the Bitcoin price. So as you can see, this was in 2014 and this is 24 days before Asian New Year. And I want you to know like it takes kind of a while because you have to think about travel. You gotta think about taking your money out. You gotta think about buying presents. So it's not gonna be like instantaneous. All those transactions aren't gonna happen at one time. It's probably gonna take around a week or two for you to get situated for you to get your you know crypto turn it into fiat then you got to go out make your travel arrangements then you got to go out and buy your presents for people so it's not like an overnight thing but as you can see like 24 days before the asian new year this big dip happened and this was like when the price of it went down by a large volume this was 2015 as you can see right 24 days before asian new year price went down again that big red candlestick and then 2016 it happened again 24 days look at that big and then this is 2017 as you can see it went down as well now this year i mean it's went down significantly lower because the market cap is a lot bigger now so you it's not it wasn't as noticeable back then in like 2014 because the market cap wasn't as big but like it's very noticeable now because there's a lot of more coins in fruition and it's, it's highly recognizable so my advice on it is prices will start to go back up again don't worry at all crypto is not failing 
it probably will happen probably every year around this time january so in my eyes i feel like this is like a black friday sale as you can see a sea red everything is down about 20 10 to 30 percent black friday sale if you got coins that you wanted to buy and you haven't bought yet go and buy them now i repeat go and buy them now because the prices will go back up to what they usually have been for the last couple of months so if you see a coin that you really wanted like you're gonna see a sea of red like all the way down basically you're gonna see a couple greens but you're gonna see mostly red so take the time go buy coins that you want to buy i'm telling you the price is going to go back up when february hits the prices you're just gonna see a sea of green again take the time if you haven't bought any ripple go buy some ripple bitcoin get some cheap bitcoin buy some neo whatever you want to buy go ahead and go buy it don't be scared things are gonna be way better in february so that is why the crypto market is crashing in january if this video helped you out be sure to leave a like and go subscribe to my channel for more content in the in the comment section down below let me know why you think the crypto market is failing i want to know your thoughts go make your multiple streams of income see you in my next video peace